NACAC President Mike Sands has hailed the ISA Boys and Girls Championships for the role it has played in the development of junior athletes from around the region and in fact has encouraged the transfer of talent throughout the Caribbean. The annual high school athletics championships has long played host to some of the brightest and most talented track and field athletes from around the region and the world. With the likes of Great Britain's Zarnell Hughes and Nathaniel Mitchell Blake all being products of the system. However, there has always been debates as to how much is too much for Jamaican high schools. But NACAC President Mike Sands believes the product that is champs is massive towards the growth and development of track and field in other territories. You go towards success. So, so when you want performance, I don't think there's no secret that Jamaica's program is the most successful um, when it comes to to the performances of uh, track and field athletes. And so if the door is open for member federations uh, to have their athletes train in Jamaica, uh, it's, it's really it's really no different, in my opinion, in its, in its broader context than our athletes performing uh, for the most part in the United States and going to school in the United States. Because at the end of the day, they go back and they compete for their country. So it makes it that much stronger uh, competition throughout the region that they now can train within the system but yet still represent their respective countries. And Sands doesn't want the exchange to stop at just track and field athletes, but wants coaches to do the same. This as he feels each member of the NACAC region has something of value that could benefit another. We're building our coaching program and so, you know, and, and the success of the program can very well be, you know, where there can be exchange of ideas and exchange of ideas would obviously mean moving coaches around. So there's no reason to object uh, or ignore the, the possibility of being able to exchange so we can bring a balance uh, because despite weaknesses in our area, we're still the stronger area uh, when it comes to athletics uh, out of all the six area associations. So again, uh, I have no, no, no objections or difficulty of the exchange of ideas because that's how we get better and we get stronger, sharing, sharing knowledge and expertise in areas where others are weak. NACAC is the Continental Confederation Governing Body of Athletics for National Governing Bodies and Multinational Federations within North America, Central America and the Caribbean. NACAC, which has 31 members, is one of six air associations of world athletics.